Hey guys, I got a treat for Rochio this time instead of uh roaches. I got I got some roaches. These are giant islander roaches, I guess. I don't really know what it is, but anyways. Uh, and these are safe for your spider, right? Um, says they don't chirp. They don't have much odor. Um, high in protein. That's pretty much it. Hmm. Oh, God. These things can climb plastic. Oh, geez. What? Oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> They're both getting out. Oh, God. This is, uh, not expected. You inside the... You could say it's unexpected. Literally, what I just said. Okay, so we got one in there. And... Oh, cool. It's stupid. Oh, nope. There we go. <laughs> Come on, Queenie. There's a roach in there for you. It's coming out the other side. Okay, cool. Wait. You lazy spider. What are you doing? She doesn't even know yet. <laughs> like, maybe we should get a stick and poke the roach. I didn't know that these things could, like, <laughs> we'll be right. plastic. You know what? We're going to go get a stick and poke this roach. <laughs> All right, Noel's got... This is really short. This ain't going to work. Tightly rolled, but too short. I'm going to grab something longer. I need to be able to reach it. <laughs> hmm. Okay, let's try a pencil. Poke that roach. Hmm. Gosh darn thing is hiding up on the top part. Why don't we take the little wood thing out oh, and just nice nudge it that. off? Queenie? Yes. Woo wee! She's like, what are you doing? <laughs> My tunnel! Oh, she doesn't want you to take it. It's hers. She loves her tunnel. There it oh, is. There it is. Queenie, look. Got you a big roach. <laughs> I I think she just let it crawl underneath her. <laughs> I don't think she knows she's supposed to eat it. No, but, but she's just she's never had a roach before. I don't think she knows what's going on. I don't think it knows what's going on. Girl, you have a roach under your butt. Poke her with the pencil. I'm not gonna poke her with the pencil. She's fine. The moment that thing moves, it's gonna like, she's gonna go all after it. It's going to activate her lunch sensors. <laughs> it's these little antennas, though. I promise, I'm not gonna move your tunnel again. Oh yeah, I think she knows it's there. Probably trying to figure out what to do. <laughs> Come at this angle. You just see it sitting down there, underneath her. What? I don't think she wants it to touch her. She's like, that's not a cricket. <laughs> Do you think it's too big for her? Hmm. I hope not. Like I said, maybe she's freaked out by it. Possibly. Poke her in the butt. I don't want to poke her in the butt. Poke her in the butt. She wants nothing to do with this roach. <laughs> Sorry, you're both just going to become friends? Yeah, she's scared of this thing. What? So we should probably get this out of there. It's food. You can eat it. 
It might be too big for her to hold on to. Hmm. I mean, you've had her for, like, what, almost a decade? She has, like, no experience eating anything other than a cricket. Hmm. So, yeah, we might just have to get it out of her tank. I don't think she's going to go for it. <sighs> well, anyway, thanks for watching. Stop it, Avery. don't think she wants it in there. I mean, she doesn't want to eat it. She just doesn't want it in her damn tunnel. Wait. She's really scared, dude. I know. This sucks. Just take the just take the cricket out. Or the cockroach out. I'm going to have to figure out how. I'm also going to have to go buy some crickets. Like, she's actually trying to escape. <laughs> she's sorry, terrified girl. of this co cockroach. I'm sorry. This isn't the, uh, I just wanted to give her a special treat. I thought she would like it. It's just in there munching her moss. Oh no, not her damn moss. Get out of there, you gross little bastard. Yeah, look at this little jerk. Eating all her moss. <laughs> well, let's get it out of there. That, that's her moss. Queenie, it's in my tunnel. Eat my moss. <sighs> Sorry, girl. Yeah. Okay, I might as well figure out how to get it out. Now, I guess I have two roaches as pets. This wasn't exactly what I was planning, but hey, that's the way life is sometimes. Okay, so earlier today we bought some roaches, and we tried to feed my tarantula Queen Brushu. She wanted absolutely nothing to do with them. So long story short, we are keeping them now as a pet. And as pets, I have two of them. The darker Roche is named Molasses, and the brighter, more sunbursty colored one... Sunburst? Uh, if you like guitars or whatever. Anyways, is named D.B. Cooper. Anyways, I got a little closure thing set up. Probably going to have to do some more work on it later, but here's what I got so far. So, yeah. Probably going to throw that all away. Anyways, they're pretty much all hidden inside. They're both <clears throat> inside this little shell thing here. It's actually a relatively good-sized gap underneath where this fake shell is right there and that's where it's hiding Ooh, you can actually see it's antenna right there so they're both under there right now um, they got some good hiding space they got vegetables um, I was told they like these tubes but as you can tell they got all wet um, got some water it's not very deep it's actually pretty shallow 
some moss, basically leftover stuff from when I set up Braccio's terrarium. And that's it. So, I don't know, it might seem around, who knows. I'm not sure if I'll really make an update on them, but yeah, we decided to keep them. I don't really know much about cockroaches. All I know is that the container says that they are giant islander roaches, but they look pretty similar to Madagascar hissing cockroaches. And I can't really find any information on giant islander roaches, so I don't know. I'll keep looking stuff up. I've definitely got a lot of research to do now, so that's pretty much it. That's a light, by the way, but I probably won't use it for this one. Anyways, thank you for watching. That's pretty much everything. Cool. I can see you. I can see you, little buddy. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to turn the lights off. Heard roaches don't like the lights, so I'll just let them rest. Whatever they feel like doing in the dark. <laughs>